Hello friends, this is Ulrike Sophia from Exploring Deeper with yet another episode of Debunking Love Songs and today I want to look at a song that is all confident, it is super super confident and I remember when this song came out and I heard it for the very first times I think we didn't have cable TV when we grew up so I think I saw these, this, this clip on MTV for the very first time with these men all dressed up in these monkey suits or something. And I saw it, I was like totally blown away and I loved that song until I kind of figured out what it was about. And at the time I was this very shy and, you know, timid young girl and I was like, oh my god, it's about sex. So, let me take a deep breath and try to sing this one for you. Sweat, baby, sweat, baby, sex is a Texas, drop me and you do the kind of stuff that only Prince would sing about to put your hands down my pants and I'll bet you feel nice Cause I'm Cisco, you're some Ebert and you're getting two thumbs up, you've got enough of two hand touch, you want it rough, you're out of bounds, I'll let you smarter, won't you cover it like my waffle house, such friends from quick enough and acts, never reach that back, like I'm good, it's like you are inclined to make me rise an hour early, just like daylight savings time. So when I hear this song, when I listen to the lyrics, it makes me think of that time when I was in high school and there was always this bunch of boys being so tough and vulnerable and all like, you know, looking at the girls, maybe secretly smoking cigarettes and um, kind of like being this very full on uh, in an attempt to hide insecurity, in an attempt to hide vulnerability. You know, there's very, when we go to relating, because this, this, of course, it still happens in relating and grown-ups, is that we hide our vulnerability in these big words and being like this tough person. And it's like, yeah, I'm going to get you. I'm going to take you. I'm going to do all these things. And that can be amazing. That can be beautiful. And that can be very juicy and sexy at some times. But it can also be a way to hide, you know, to hide what's really going on. And in this song, there's no feeling, there's no sharing of any emotion, actually, except for lust. Um, if that's what it is, you know, it can also be a very smart way to just, you know, diverge from any feelings and go into this, like, see me, I'm full of confidence and you can touch my body and you feel, you feel my, you know, you feel my nuts, you feel my, you know, you could always say, also say that, like, you can, you'll feel my toughness you'll feel my masculinity um whatever that may mean you'll feel you know you you'll feel me you'll feel my balls you know it's it's mm, very tough very very tough all right going on in the same way it's like yeah it's all it's all about sex. you know another thing is that when we focus everything on sex it's it's another strategy to to not go into feeling you know it's this, this famous diversion between love and sex where many of us many people of us have this trouble of connecting our heart with our pelvis with our genitals so it's like either lust or love but both at the same time is a scary thing. Like, think about it for yourself. It's like, for many people, it's it's really scary to feel both, you know, because sex can be an easy way to stay away from vulnerability. 
And then when we feel vulnerable, we actually feel too scared to have sex because both at the same time, that is like bearing your soul. <laughs> so like this, 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 this song, these lyrics can also be like that. You know, on the one hand, it can be like they're the tough boys, and if you see the the video clip, they 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 look like the tough boys, uh, the tough boys like. Here I am, you know, kind of like over screaming themselves, like putting themselves firmly forward, but so firm that they are they are not hearing, they're not hearing the voice of their inner world. And then on the other hand, there is this this focus on sex, which is another which is another diversion from feeling, which can be another diversion of feeling. It doesn't have to be, but it could be. So this song to me, it feels very much like um, I'm a tough person. I could fuck you to, to another dimension, you see how tough I am, but there is no vulnerability in it at all. And for, you know, if we want to have healthy relationship, it needs a certain degree of vulnerability. Yeah. And sometimes full vulnerability may feel too much, but then, you, you know, for yourself, you can practice like, can I be a little bit more vulnerable? What would it look like if I share just a little bit more of myself? Maybe that's not a smile. You know, because the smile can be all politics, you know, it can be like just a social statement, but not real. So if you want a little bit of homework next time you wear the beloved or a dear friend or your partner, whoever, you see, like, can you show just a little bit more of yourself without going into any diversion strategy like sexuality or being all tough, but just to show you to show them a little bit more of where you actually are in this moment. And then see what happens. Because, yeah, many of us are afraid of the consequences of that. That when we show a little bit more of ourselves, we might get rejected. And very often that's the voice in our head that tells us that. But maybe that's not true. So just as an experiment, you know, it might be too scary to just open up and show yourself fully. But just as an experiment, next time, again, when you're with a beloved friend, your partner, show a little bit more of yourself and see what happens. See what happens. If they, maybe you are being an invitation for them to show a little bit more of themselves too. Or maybe they appreciate your honesty and what you're showing. To learn, to, to teach yourself that a little bit of vulnerability is a beautiful thing. Mm. So I hope that helped. Please check out a few other of my videos of debunking love songs. Check my website exploringdeeper.com. Uh, leave your comments in the reactions below. I love to hear from you. Take good care wherever you are. Mwah.